Halos lahat naman ng klase ng motor ay pwede mong gamitin ng pangmahabaang biyahe. Pero ang tinatawag na touring bike ay talagang designed para sa mga road trip adventures. Ilan lang sa mga features nito ay may malaking fairings at windshield para mas relax ang biyahe, mas malaking fuel tank at mas relax na seating position. Kaya naman ang mga motor na ito ang perfect na pang road trip companion. Kung road trip companion ang hanap ninyo, siguradong hindi kayo mabibitin dito sa Kawasaki Versus 1000. Isa ito sa pinakasikat na touring bikes na binibenta ng Kawasaki dito sa ating bansa. At sa ating mga kamotor na mahilig sa adventure, siguradong kilalang kilala nila ang Kawasaki Versus 1000. All you need to do is load it with gas at hindi ka maubusan ng adventure ideas for your next long ride. This is a sports touring motorcycle, 1,043 cc's, equipped with ABS and has a 21-liter fuel tank capacity. Alright, sinusubukan natin tong Versus 1000 from Kawasaki. This is of course their premium uh, touring bike. Uh, para sa akin, ang dating nito is more of a sports touring bike. Uh, pang malayuan ang takbuhan but very very comfortable. Ang market ng bike na to is it's uh, intended for riders who see themselves going on adventures na mostly kanye ang tatakbuhin nila. Pero dahil sa comfort level, extreme comfort level talaga na uh, nararamdaman mo on the Versus 1000, um, you can really imagine yourself doing hundreds if not thousands of miles uh, on a bike like this. Here in uh, regular traffic conditions, although malaki siya, it's actually big enough to maneuver. Um, of course, medyo kailangan mong bantayan yung mga clearances. It's not as easy to put this bike through small spaces pagdating sa singitan in traffic. Pero bawing-bawi ka naman sa comfort level. Now, one of the things that stand out about the Versys is of course the fact na inline four siya. Meaning, four-cylinder bike which are known for being very, very smooth. Uh, pagdating sa power delivery, swabing-swabe. Parang ang pwede kang mag-shift into the first two or three gears at iiwan mo na lang doon because the bike has so much power na kayang-kaya niyang uh, humatak from uh, almost any gear. Ang isa pang dagdag sa kanyang uh, comfort uh, levels is of course the way the suspension is set up. Super suabe siya. It's really made for uh, going long distances in comfort. So, itong mga medyo baku-bakong daan, uh, potholes, at uh, imperfect road surface, naku, mani-mani lang sa Versys uh, 1000. On the open road, uh, stretching your legs out like this, na nakatayo, is a good way to relieve some of the, uh, the road miles. And in this position, komportable komportable siya. You can grip the tank uh, with your knees. Very comfortable ang kanyang handlebar height for this standing position na... Uh, you know, alternative position when you want to relax. Pag umabot na sa open road ang adventure mo, ibang klase ang comfort level talaga netong uh, Kawasaki Versus 1000. It's a very, very comfortable bike, but at the same time, it's also a very high-performance sport touring machine. Tulad nga nang nabanggit ko kanina, medyo mas road-oriented tong setup ng uh, Uh, versus 1000. Um, it has 1717 wearing very uh, sporty rubber. No? It, it's the same kind of tires na makikita mo on many sport bikes. Although uh, slightly harder compound so you get better mileage lalo na pag uh, malayuan ng takbuhan. But uh, really the thing that stands out for me for the uh, Versys is yung comfort level niya iba talaga eh. uh, The smoothness of the inline 4 engine cannot be beat. Uh, whether you're you know, on slower pleasure miles like this or pag inabot ka na ng medyo highway miles na mabilisan, super smooth pa rin talaga ang power delivery ng inline 4. Ang isang maganda is uh, you have very little vibrations coming from a multi-cylinder engine like this. 
So hindi siya masyadong nakakangawit. Alam mo yung feeling na medyo nangawit yung kamay mo o yung mga paa mo from the vibrations. Here on an inline 4 uh, engine, uh, you know, riders who are looking for smoothness will find what they're looking for. Lalo na pagdating sa rear view uh, mirrors, yung uh, view mo is not uh, uh, disturbed dahil wala masyadong shake at wala masyadong vibration because super smooth talaga ang inline 4 engine. The braking is also excellent. You can count on Kawasaki's uh, version of ABS braking to keep things under control. This bike actually has uh, you know, a, a number of different sensors. I believe this has a five-axis uh, sensor system na minimeasure niya yung speed mo, yung uh, lean angle mo, uh, and it tailors uh, the bike's power delivery to make sure that you keep uh, traction to a maximum uh, when you're on these roads. Particularly pagka medyo ganito, damp conditions na medyo paambon-ambon. Uh, traction control is such an important thing. Uh, you also have the uh, capability to tailor the power of the bike. You can run it on full power, you can detune it a little bit, uh, which is useful kung medyo baguhan ka to large capacity bikes or large displacement bikes like this. Um, but it doesn't give up anything in performance, in my opinion. This is a bike that you can put through the paces na kaya kaya mo makipagsabayan sa mga full-blown sport bikes but still have uh, you know, a high degree of comfort. Lalo na dito sa upuan na uh, nakakabit dito sa Versus 1000. It's a very, very comfortable seat. Ang sarap ng padding niya at talagang hindi mga ngawit on these uh, longer rides where you're gonna put in a lot of road miles. And I wanna underline that, road miles. This is a very road-oriented machine. So, bagay siya sa mga riders na naghahanap ng uh, adventure bike or sports touring bike uh, that he imagines using on uh, long road journeys. At first glance, mapapansin mo na agad ang sporty and aggressive styling ng Versys. With its sharp lines and edges, guwapo at may dating ang sport bike na ito. Sa twin headlights pa lang, tawag pansin na. It's also equipped with an adjustable windscreen that you can adjust without the use of tools. Very practical dahil madali mo itong may adjust depending on your preference providing you with excellent wind protection. Another note, may heel guard pads din ang Versys para makaiwas sa pag-chip ng paint ng bike nyo. Sa cockpit naman, makikita natin ang instrument cluster nito, mixing a classic analog tachometer plus a multifunction LCD panel. This is a bike designed for long rides. Unang-una, kontrolado mo ang seating position mo. Pwedeng upright ang upo at pwedeng mag-adjust ng konti dahil sa slim seat design at knee grip karakteristik ng tank. Mahalaga na komportable ang upuan ng isang touring bike, kaya kahit slim ang seat na ito, komportable pa rin dahil meron itong adequate cushioning at support. Isa pang hinahanap sa mga adventure bikes ang power, and this bike has it. Pag-aarangkada, mararamdaman mo ang racing DNA ng bike na ito. You can feel all of its 118 horses under you, which is certainly more than enough power in any situation you may encounter. What I like about this bike is how smooth it delivers all that power from the inline 4. Magandang throttle response niya. You also have a 3-mode Kawasaki traction control to give you enhanced stability in slippery conditions and optimum traction naman kapag gustuin mong umarangkada sa track or on a long stretch of road. Power mode selection will help newbie riders tame this bike especially if you're not used to having this much bike. Usually, big bikes like these would offer unending power, pero ang paborito kong feature ng bike na ito ay ang Eco Mode. More fuel efficiency, more adventures. It's definitely a must-have feature para sa mga adventure seekers.